Of course, the winner is the most important, the reaction of the winner. No, that's not what I look at. I look at the reaction of the runners-up. I had very limited knowledge prior. I grew up in Texas, and so we grew up around them. It's definitely part of the culture, um, but hadn't been super aware of them. And then when we booked the show, we got to go and sit down with some two beauty queens who were part of one of the local systems and kind of interrogate them and ask them all the questions. I got to know them and their passions. And of course, Gloria and learning about her legacy, that also informed what we were doing. Yeah, the same thing. I, um, I grew up in Texas, so beauty pageants are, you know, a big part of the culture there, but I didn't have any sisters or any cousins who did them. So it wasn't until I, you know, booked this role and uh, my character is based on a real beauty coach, Bill Alverson, and so I met with him a lot, a lot, and he taught me everything I needed to know. I mean, I'm not playing Bill Alverson, you know, but uh, I've never been fortunate enough before a role to have someone who's that strong of a mentor to sort of, you know, I got he gave me the express lane into sort of beauty pageant coaching in a way that I, was absolutely necessary for the, for the role. I love the Q&A so much. I mean, it's helpful for me to know kind of people's platforms. Really, that's to me where the heartbeat is. But yeah, I quite enjoy the Q&A because it really is so much improv. It's my favorite thing about our job is watching people who are so good at this come from their place and their frame of reference. And I think pageants are very similar. I look forward to the long gowns. I always think, um, you know, that's the fashion show for me. The Q&A, um, yeah, I, I like it too, but I'm kind of deaf to it already. Because <laughs> I know the answers right. that they're going to come up with. So, of course, the winner is the most important. The reaction of the winner, no, that's not what I look at. I look at the reaction of the runners-up. Mm. Because are they happy? Are they okay? Maybe they'll try again next year. Mm. No. I'm generally terrified the entire time at a beauty pageant because I'm so afraid for someone to fall or to oh, stumble true. over something. Yes. And so uh, I really like when it's over uh, yes. and everyone's gotten through it gracefully and beautifully. Yeah, that's very scary, especially usually it's made of um, plastic or lucite, the, the stairs. Yeah. During my time, they even would have uh, waterfalls and dancing fountains wow. and you know, that water kind of trickles on the stairs right. and it makes it very slippery and you're on your own. Oh. You know, that's I'm very nervous scary. right now thinking about it. <laughs> I would do it in sneakers. <laughs> <laughs> and you're using usually these very high, new, slippery heels yeah. that yeah. don't fit you well. <laughs> and you're kind of shaking, you know, and then trying to be cool, tucking your stomach, yes. pushing out everything mm -hmm. you can. You know, so it's very difficult. Reminders. <laughs> Reminds me. <laughs> Most like effervescent, most like always happy and pretty resilient. Chris Gorham who plays Bob Barnard. He's just like seemingly always in a good mood. Mr. Congeniality might be Michael Provost. When you said, you know, Perky or Papios or whatever, I was gonna give that to Arden. Yeah, yeah. Because Arden's a just, she, I mean, most, most like a supernova. She's a wind up toy. She's the yeah. silliest yeah. for sure. Silliest. Yeah, yeah. she yeah. wins. Well, I met him when he was very kind, very good. But the next time I came, he was down with the cold and I was kind of going towards him. Maybe he didn't remember me because no, remember I remember you were, you had a cold yes. and you said you were feeling really... Mm. But she, yeah, Miss Congeniality. <laughs> me, Mr. <And> cold. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> flu. No, he had a bad yeah. flu, I think, on him, right? <laughs> Mr. Take your right of yeah. until very late. Yeah. Yes. So, uh, <laughs> nice. Mr. Cold. <laughs> Mr. Freeze was taken. Yeah. <laughs>